adding pictures to a report on a PC. This video will cover how to add pictures to your inspection report on a PC. Adding pictures to your report is very simple and you can do so using a simple drag and drop method. The way this works is you will set it up to where you have the Palm Tech program open side by side with the folder that has your inspection pictures in it. To do this, first resize the Palm Tech window so it only takes up part of the screen. Next, open up the folder that has your pictures in it and then resize that window to line up to the right of your Palm Tech window. Now to add pictures into the report, scroll through your pictures, click on the picture you want and then drag it over to the line you want to add it to and then drop it in by releasing the mouse. As you can see, the picture is now in the report. You can also highlight more than one picture at a time and drag and drop multiple pictures to a single line at once. If you want to add decorations or edit the picture, simply click on the picture to bring up the edit image window and you can make your changes. Let's click on the picture to see what options that we have. The edit image screen gives you several different options for editing your picture. The first option in the top right corner is the image size. Here you can make the picture larger or smaller. Below the image size is a button for make sizes default. If you click on this button, then the image height and width that you have selected for this picture will become the default image size for all new pictures that get added into the reports in the future. Next, we have a lock aspect ratio, which makes it so when you adjust the height or the width of the picture, the other will automatically change proportionately. After that, we have the option to change the resolution that the images get added in at. Next, we have decorations. There are three types of decorations to choose from, arrows, ellipses, and zoom boxes. And let's say we wanna add a few to this picture. Let's go ahead and draw an arrow. To draw an arrow, select arrow from the drop-down list. Then click and hold on the picture to start drawing the arrow. Move the mouse to where you want the arrow to end and let go of the mouse when you have it the way you want. You can draw as many arrows as you want. The second decoration is an ellipse. The ellipse will work the same way. Finally, we can draw a zoom box. Below the decoration dropdown is a dropdown to change the color of your decorations. Let's change the zoom box to blue and draw your zoom box. As you can see, the zoom box enlarges a part of the picture so you can draw more attention to what is going on. That is a look at decorations. If you make a mistake as you're adding them in, you can click on the undo last to remove the last decoration you added in or you can click on the undo all to remove all the decorations. Below the decorations, we have the option to add text to the picture. Let's add the phrase sidewalk is cracked to the picture by typing it in the text entry box. Once it is typed in, we now have the ability to control where it shows up and the size of it. Let's change it to be in the bottom center and large. You can add multiple sets of text to a picture simply by clicking Start Another Text button. The last options of the Edit Image screen are the arrows pointing downward below the picture. These are used to rotate your picture. When you have finished making all your changes to the picture, click OK. This concludes a video on adding pictures to your reports on a PC.